What's up guys? So today is Wednesday, July 27th, I think, and um, today I kind of just wanted to make a vlog where I was just kind of sitting down talking to you guys about some things because I just want to like, I don't know, kind of like update you guys on anything. I kind of wanted to catch you guys up on my life. I think the last, yeah, the last vlog that I um, uploaded was my sister's birthday, which I hope you guys liked. She really enjoyed her birthday and I'm really glad she actually went for her permit test she got her permit and she's been practicing driving up at our high school that I graduated from and that she goes to <laughs> yeah so I'm probably not gonna keep my glasses on because of the maybe I will I don't know I was having trouble with my contacts this morning like I put the one in the one felt fine but this one was like burning my eyes so I took them out so I'm going with glasses today so yeah like I said I'm going to update you guys on some things but first I went shopping the other day and I think what I'm gonna do every time I go shopping is just do a mini haul because I like watching them on YouTube like every time someone has a haul I like click on it and I love watching what people get I don't know why so maybe if you're the same way I'm gonna do a little haul for you guys I went to forever 21 I have a bag right there and I also went to Target to get some stuff for my dorm this year and where else did I go? Charlotte Roos. So I'm going to show you guys a few things that I bought. I didn't go crazy or anything. I just bought a few things, but I want to show you guys what I got. So yeah. Okay. I love hauls and maybe I will take my glasses off. I feel like they're distracting. Okay. I just can't see myself because I'm blind. Okay, so the first thing that I got from Charlotte Reese is actually this really pretty gray romper, and I'm obsessed with it. I really like the lace up in the front and this little, like, crisscross thing. I don't know what it's called, but it's, like, really trendy right now, and I'm actually going to be wearing this for my birthday dinner with my friends on Monday, which, oh my gosh, that's coming up. That's Monday. It's gonna be August next week. Did anyone else think of that? Anyways, so yeah, I'm having a birthday dinner with my friends on Monday, August 1st, so yeah, that's next Monday. Mostly because I wanted to get all of my friends together before we all go back to school because the month of August is going to just be really busy for me and I'm not going to really have that much time to hang out with people. Plus, it's hard to tell whenever all of my friends are going back to school because everyone goes back to school at different times. So, so I kind of just wanted to have a day where we all get dressed up, go down to Pittsburgh and have some dinner before everyone leaves me but um and I wanted to have it on Monday because my actual birthday is next Wednesday and that's kind of just going to be a day that I'm with my family and maybe TJ and stuff so I like to spend my birthday with my family mostly because my mom's the one that birthed me in the first place so it would make sense right <laughs> but TJ's probably gonna come over and do stuff too this was $28.99 and they were actually having a sale at the time where you can get a romper and get shoes um, for $12.50 so I got shoes and I think they're really cute they have like a thick heel so I think it'll be fine to walk in them they're like a really pretty pink color like dark pink color and I really like them so so I'm excited to wear these on Monday so that's everything I got from Charlotte Roost from Forever 21 I got a few little necklaces it's a choker and I really like chokers they're like really trendy right now so I got this one and it's gold and I don't know if you can tell I mean I'm obviously vlogging on my phone so it's not the best quality um, but it's gold and it has little and it has little crystals in it and it's just a triangle I thought it was a really cute little choker and it comes with these two gold chains as well so I thought that was really cute I also got another necklace and this one is just a little dainty like silver necklace with the little circle on the end the last thing that I got from Forever 21 is this t-shirt dress which I'm obsessed with my sister my mom actually just got my sister um, a couple t-shirt dresses for her birthday and I actually ended up wearing it wearing one of her t-shirt dresses like the next day and the next day and the next day because it's so comfortable so I was like okay I obviously have to buy myself one so I, got, I just got a plain black t-shirt dress and I just think it's super cute and if I'm ever lazy if I'm ever too lazy to put together an outfit I can just throw this on I just thought it'd be really easy to wear and it's so soft like I'm obsessed with it so I got this in the size small yeah small and it was only $12.90 so that's a pretty good deal and then both of the necklaces were only like $2.90 so that's a pretty good deal as well so that's everything that I got from Forever 21 and now so then a couple days ago I went to Target because I wanted to get a few things for school because I don't want anything to sell out before um, I don't want anything that I really need to sell out because 
that happens that actually happened to me last year so long story short I got a bedspread last year for my dorm and I'm actually sitting on it right now it came with this pillow if you if you watched um, if you've been watching my vlogs for a while you would actually know what it looks like but it came with this pillow if it kind of gives you an idea so it's like a really pretty Tiffany blue color I'm obsessed with the color and everything but the cover the duvet cover now this may sound stupid, but I guess I didn't really know what a duvet cover was. So apparently you have to put a comforter inside the duvet cover, whatever. So I didn't know that. I got it from overstock.com. It looked really fluffy and like comfortable on the picture online. And then when I got it in the mail, it was like in a package this big. And I was like looking at my mom, I was like, is this the comforter? So we open it and it's just like, it's as light as a sheet. And I was like, is this supposed to be my comforter? So I found out like halfway through the year, my friend Kiana noticed that I was supposed to put a sheet under that. So I'm just stupid. I didn't realize that. So I didn't realize that a duvet cover was that until now. But you learn something new every day, right? So anyways, I'm just going to keep this one, the blue one, at my house as I'm in school. So... And I'm, I don't like like patterns and stuff because I like to have pillows that can be like all pretty and patterny so I just got a plain gray comforter set and this is a twin XL twin and you have to make sure this is actually kind of nice tip for you guys who are going to college this year if you guys don't know you should get an XL well if you're in a dorm if you're in an apartment it might be a different story but if you're in a dorm I know that you have to get an XL twin because I guess the beds are like fitted differently I in dorms um, so make sure that you get an XL twin and XL sheets. So a little tip for you guys if you're going to college this year. It's by the brand Exhilaration, if you wanted to know. But see how like in this picture, it looks all ruffly and like puffy and comfortable and stuff? Well, I believe it because it's in a huge package. This, however, the comforter that I bought last year was not in a big package. It was in a package that you could fit like a shirt in, so. And I didn't get like a lot of things because I already have a bunch of stuff from last year. If you didn't know, I'm going to be a sophomore in college this year. So I already have like stuff from last year that I could just use again. But I thought this would be helpful to keep in my dorm because I'm like obsessed with like anything planner related. I also got this door hanger thing. Um, so this will come in handy because I had one yet last year, but it was actually my roommate. So... I had to get my own this year. Then I also got, this is my favorite thing I got, this huge body pillow and it came, well it didn't come with the cover, but I bought the cover separately. So I think the cover was like $10 and the pillow underneath was $10. So this together would be $20, but it is so worth it. It's so comfortable. I've slept with it like every night now. Like I couldn't wait to like put it in my dorm. So I obviously like had to open it, had to put the cover on. I sleep with it every night now. It's very, very comfortable. So this is my body pillow. The last thing that I bought, if you guys, well, if you guys do watch all of my vlogs, you would know that I'm obsessed with planners. It has the little tabs on the side, which I like. And it has like the whole monthly planner thing. And then it goes into the weekly planner thing. So I really like it. I already wrote a bunch in it. So I'm excited to use this in the school year. Hopefully it'll keep me motivated to do my homework. That's everything for my haul. So now, I just wanted to kind of update you guys with my life. So I don't even know where to start. <laughs> Basically, I mean, I'm not really updating you guys on anything, but it's kind of just like a rant about a little bit of stress that I've been dealing with. Like, no one really knows about it because I don't really like to show that I'm like upset about something and I'm not really upset about it. It's just like kind of like stressful to me. So if you watch my vlog channel, you probably know that I have a main channel because you might have been sent to my vlog channel from my main channel. I don't know how you found me, but you found me. But I have a main channel and I haven't been posting on it very frequently. The last thing that I posted on, on it was my vacation montage and I've been home from vacation for about two months now. Maybe not even that. Maybe a month. We'll say a month. <laughs> Anyways, point of the story is it shouldn't take me a month to film and upload a new video. And especially in summer. That's why I'm kind of being like a little bit hard on myself because I'm saying like it's summer. I have so much more free time than I do during like the school season. And I like kind of get hard on myself because I am like 
kind of frustrated that I haven't really been making any videos. I haven't been thinking of any like new ideas for videos and it's just really hard and I really want to make content that people will like and I will like um, because making, filming videos, editing videos is something that I love so much. Like I love to edit, I love to film, anything that has to do with videography, photography, like I love it. But lately, it's just been really hard for me to get back into that like, I don't know, back into that state of mind, I guess. I don't know if I'm speaking English right now. So when I film videos, I obviously have someone help me film and it's either my sister or my boyfriend TJ and they both do a really great job with it and I give them a lot of credit for helping me whenever I need help. But TJ has a job, he works every single day until 3 o'clock and I have a job in my usual shift, I work different shifts here and there, but my usual shift is 4 to 8. So if you can see how that doesn't work out, like he gets off at 3 or 3.30 and I have to go to work at 4. So I don't really have time for him to help me to film. My sister, she actually just got a job as well. So she works every other day in the morning, but then I have to go to work. And it's like, we just don't have a lot of time to film and do things that I would like to do. When you, when you really want to make a good video, you spend a lot of time on that video. Personally, school is very important to me, and I think that getting an education, getting a degree, going to school is really important for me. Plus, I just want to experience college in general. Like, I, I, I had so much fun my first year. Like, there were, like, ups and downs here and there, obviously, for everyone there is. But I just really want to experience that, and I don't want to, like, you know, like, I don't want to just not go to school and spend time on videos like I would rather I would rather have time to spend time on videos and have time for schoolwork as well which is very hard I guess my point I guess I just want to apologize though for how my main channel has been like obviously I've had these goals for my channel since the beginning of the year since the beginning of 2016 like I've had goals like I want my channel to grow and I want my channel to be fun to watch I used to be like so consistent with like ideas and like I used to like always think of a new idea to do something and I because I don't want to copy other people's work like I don't want to it's hard to explain like I don't want to obviously you have to go to Pinterest for inspiration but I don't always want to have like my ideas come from Pinterest like I, I used to always have new ideas running in, through my mind all the time and it's just stopped and I don't know why like maybe because I'm stressed out about it maybe I have to just like calm down about it not think about it as much but it's just like really gotten to me because I really want to make good content for you guys and co good content for me to watch like later on in the future and be like how look how far I've come and stuff like that I really don't know if I'm making any sense I don't know I kind of just wanted to vent to people and I know I don't have that many subscribers on this channel but that also kind of makes me a little more confident to like spread this tell you guys why I'm kind of stressed out and stuff because whoever is subscribed I know that you guys are subscribed because you like to watch my videos and I appreciate that and I actually I feel a lot com a lot more confident telling you guys um, the people who are subscribed to me about what's going on in my life so I just want to thank you guys whoever is subscribed to this channel for um, watching my videos and being a supporter of my videos um, on this channel or even if you are subscribed on my main channel, thank you very much like it means a lot to me um, And I'm not saying that I'm like looking for a ton of subscribers I'm not I just want to like YouTube is a place to show how much Creativity you have in making videos and like if you are a singer you can show how much creativity you have in like your voice I guess but um, I just really like um, I just really like the idea of YouTube and kind of showing your talent I guess is what I'm trying to say. I'm still going to think positive about all this. Maybe something will come my way. Maybe I'll think of an idea soon and be like hey I'm gonna have a new video for you guys on my channel. But as for right now um, I don't I don't know what to give you guys. <laughs> but um, I'm going to end it now. Thank you guys so much for listening. Hopefully my rant wasn't like too bad. Hopefully you guys don't think I'm like crazy. But I just thought that I could vent to you guys and um, I feel a lot better. So thank you guys for watching and subscribing. If you haven't already, definitely subscribe and be my friend. Hopefully I will be able to think of some content for you guys and I can get my life back on track. So 
Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in my next vlog. Bye!